Good morning and happy Thursday. I am up before the kids, the kids are still asleep. It is a school day, so I'm just kind of showing you like what I do day to day, especially while Tim's not here, it's a little bit different. So I'm sure you can hear in the background the fan. I have made, they have pancakes for breakfast, little like protein pancakes. And so I have the fan going just to cool those off so they can eat them. They usually eat one pancake a piece and then some fruit and some milk. And that's normally their breakfast. They don't eat a whole lot for breakfast. I always try to get them to eat more and they never will. So their biggest meal is usually like lunch and dinner. But Jackson and the baby are still asleep. I'm gonna try to go get Jackson up so we can get ready for school. And yeah, he slept in a little bit later today. He must have, it did pour. Last night was like a huge storm. And so it just sounded like I slept really well actually. The storm was just like so, it's so peaceful to sleep in a, in a thunderstorm. It was like, thundering and lightning all night and it was just like heavy heavy rain so i feel like that's why jackson's sleeping a little bit later today but let me go get him and then we're gonna get ready for school all right the little baby is awake what are you eating watch out watch pancake, pancake? yeah all right it is a little bit later jackson's off to school the baby is at a little baby gymnastics class and i have to clean up this kitchen real quick and then i have to start editing but i just have to say i'm so happy that Jackson loves school. Because I know that sometimes going to school for some kids can be like a struggle. And he just very happily goes. He really loves his friends and his teachers. So I'm very thankful <laughs> that my mornings are not super hard like having to like force him to go to school. You know what I mean? So that I'm very happy about. But yeah, so I'm back home. I'm gonna clean up. And I also have to figure out, so in the last home vlog, you guys saw that I did like an, an Instagram thing where I like dressed up like Agatha from WandaVision. And so she's like a witch and she has her hands are kind of painted black when she's like in her witchy form. And so I did that to kind of like go into character for the Instagram thing, but it won't come off my fingernails. Like, look at that, it looks horrible. It will not come off. I tried everything. So I gotta figure out I gotta figure something out because I can't go through life like this. So, uh, so yeah, if you have any suggestions, let me know. I will try it. But I've tried like makeup remover, uh, nail polish remover. It's not even permanent. I literally used uh, an eyeshadow. I used eyeshadow. I, I don't know. So yeah, let me know if you have any ideas. I will try it. All right, so I made my breakfast having a little cheesy eggs and English muffin. Normally I would eat this on my snowman plate. If you've been with us for a while, you might know the snowman plate, but uh, Jackson's been using it, so it's dirty. And it actually makes me really happy that Jackson likes the snowman plate, because I feel like I'm passing down my legacy. <laughs> is this, the snowman plate is my legacy. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, I'm having a little breakfast and then I'm gonna start work. And the other thing I've been doing is I have been re-watching Housewives, uh, the OC, like Orange County Housewives. And I have to say, this might be like a controversial opinion, but I think that Shannon has, everybody, she's like not as bad. I know everybody is kind of like, oh, Shannon, you know, like she's like a loose cannon. She's like the crazy one. But after re-watching from the beginning, like from her, from the beginning, but also from like her beginning when she entered the show, I think that people made her out to be crazier than she was. I, I feel bad for Shannon, especially with what's going on with her in the current season. And if you don't watch Housewives, sorry, this is just a little quick tangent, but she, I feel bad for her. I think she was constantly made to feel crazy. Lydia, especially. Like, I used to actually, like, thinking back, I used to love Lydia. But, like, watching the way that she treated Shannon makes me so sad. I was like, Shannon didn't even do anything. So, anyway, there's my little uh, hot take, my little housewives hot take while I'm re-watching the, um, the OC seasons. But, I, yeah, I feel bad for Shannon. I mean, obviously, like, what she did is wrong. Like, she shouldn't have driven that car and hit that house and all of that. That's like not good, obviously. I don't condone that. But I think the way that she was treated in previous seasons just makes me feel bad for her. So anyway, now I'm gonna have some breakfast and then I'm going to get some editing done on our Halloween Horror Nights RIP tour that we did. And hopefully you will see that soon or hopefully you've already seen it. I don't know how these are gonna go up, like the order of the uploads. But uh, thank you guys for being patient with me 
while I try to get through all of this Halloween stuff. I really appreciate that. So yeah, I'm gonna eat breakfast and I'll be right back. Okay, so it is a few days later. <laughs> I thought for sure in my hot in my head, I'm like, I'm gonna do like this, you know, like how we how we do our mornings when Tim's gone type thing, especially with school being back in. Didn't really turn out as I hoped that it would. It's just been thing after thing after thing since Tim's been gone. My computer completely broke, so that's why I have been uploading um, sporadically and not as consistently as I normally do. I think when Tim tried to fix my computer, he may have done the opposite, I'm not sure. So I had to get a new computer. That was something that we weren't really, wasn't, you know, planned. So that was a fun, that was fun. So I'm gonna actually go pick it up today from the Mall of Millennia. And our sprinklers broke. So that was another fun added cost. And then, you know, just, just regular everyday life stuff. Everything's kind of, I wonder if like something is in retrograde. Everybody that I ask is like, yeah, it is. Or no, it's not. So I really don't know. <laughs> what's going on there must be like some planet doing some weird thing that's making stuff in my life go a little haywire or maybe it's just my life you know like borat like my life <laughs> um, so yeah so i am gonna go run and grab a coffee because i need you know what i just need a little treat i need a little treat right now because everything is going wrong um i also really i ran into jackson has a um i'm getting my my cup. Jackson has a, a step stool in the bathroom that's in my bathroom right now because Tim's out of town. So I'm just doing everything in, in my bathroom to make things a little more streamlined in the morning and before bed. And I ran into it and I really hurt my foot. So I deserve a little treat, you know? <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna go do that. I'll be right back and then we'll get started. Today will be the day that I show you the day. Today will be that day. So I'll be right back. A little more caffeinated. I do half caffeine in my coffee. I can't do full caffeine anymore, but I'll be slightly more caffeinated. And yeah, see you in a second. So I didn't end up going to get coffee. I went out to lunch with my sister and we went to this little Turkish restaurant that I really like. We had some tea, some Turkish tea that was very delicious. And then we got a feta appetizer plate with some fresh veggies and peppers. And I got the Adana chicken kebab, very delicious. My sister also got a chicken kebab. She loved it as well, it was great. Great time was had by all. So it is a little bit later on. I just recorded my very first, not my very first, my first That Tracks podcast with Nick and Francie. It was very exciting. So I wanna show you guys my setup here. They're on a little box of shoes cause I couldn't figure out, uh, I'm no Tim, I'm no Tim tracker. That's for sure. But here they are, look at this. I'm proud of you. I think that it, I think it's gonna be a fun one. I think it's gonna turn out great. Also, we just sounded like Tim hardcore just then. I said, I'm proud of you. And she said, you did it. Wow. <laughs> Tim has influenced our so much. You've been Tim-fluenced. <laughs> yeah. I love it. Uh, well, thank you guys for having me. I had so much fun. Oh, and um, you heard it here first. Me and Francie are going on a cruise. Yeah. So yeah. get ready. Get... You have to go listen to the episode now to figure out what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good night, you guys. All right, so now it is Monday the 9th and Tim is on his way home. We're going to pick him up right now. We're headed to the Delta like arrival area and hopefully he's there. His flight landed at one minute ago. So he didn't have any checked bags. He only had carry-ons. So he should be off the plane like fairly quickly, but I'm so excited. I hope he didn't have like a, a bad flight though because this storm looks pretty dark out here. There it is. All right, we're here. We're just kind of waiting until they tell us to move, but his flight was early. He's at 32. Oh, okay, so he's like way. Behind. Okay, we we had to park a little bit farther away from his like little gate area because it's pouring outside right now and we, I didn't want to have to keep circling and there's nobody in here. It's kind of like oddly quiet at the airport right now. I don't know if you can see him. He's right there. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> you're back! Yeah. Oh, uh, yes! You're getting a little sneak peek at our new merch! Oh, look at your glasses all I know, they got, it's like so cold in the car. Uh, I love y'all. Missed you a lot. <laughs> I missed you too. Alright, but let's get in the car because I don't want to get yelled at. Okay. Although it's less, it's less, they're less yelly this time. Yeah, because I got here earlier. Yeah, there's like not as many cars. It's nice. This is the time to fly in. Oh, it's awesome to have your shirt on. What do you see? <laughs> 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 
Are you so excited to see Daddy? Hey. <laughs> hey, buddy. Um, you're squishing me, Dad. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, bud. So now that Tim is home, I basically showed you nothing while you were gone. Oh. Showed you guys nothing of my week. Uh, lots of stuff did happen, but I just, honestly, I just didn't have the like emotional, mental capacity to vlog. There was a lot going on. So while Tim was away, my computer fully broke. Yeah. And which is why you guys didn't get videos for like a few days in a row because my computer basically would get really, really loud. The screen would turn black. Like the beach ball would come on. It would not go off. The screen would turn black and then it would just shut off. And it would, I was like, oh. <laughs> I was in the middle of editing um, some videos and the I was in the GPU middle. The GPU was overheating. Well, but it also like, I think it was just time. Like I don't yeah. think there was like a lot of salvaging the situation because I would turn the computer off. Well, the computer would turn off. And then I would let it sit for a minute, turn it back on, and then I would have 20 minutes, and then it would do the same thing. So then I turned it off the whole night, and then I got two hours out of it the next day. And I just was like, I can't work like this. Yeah, and this <laughs> like, was the whole the whole reason that I started on the computer journey to begin with, is because the computer was giving us so much trouble. It's, so I was it's, like, let me try to salvage this. But we didn't have, the computer wasn't like so old. Right. Do you know what I mean? So it's just like a bummer. It, I wasn't, planning on buying another computer so soon and the computer that we use is not cheap so it was just like a bummer to have to like shell out that money for and we need it like it's you know it's a necessity for what we do but i was just like dang it <laughs> so, oh dang it <laughs> that's literally Jen what said let's be financially responsible i try to be fine i'm i'm very much the financially responsible one in our relationship like i am not the one that's like you know let's go spend a bunch of money on silly stuff Jen will ask me to buy stuff and I'm like, do whatever you want to, buy whatever you want to. And but see, it's I'm like, just like, I don't, I don't know. I know that, you know, it's not a good idea to do that. So I try not to, but the computer was a necessity. I had to, I had to buy it, but it was just kind of a bummer. So hold on, my battery's dying. Give me one second. Long story short, we had to make a large purchase that we weren't planning on making. So that made me sad, but we're fine. Like it didn't, you know, like, make or break us so but it was just a bummer you know how that goes so then also while you were gone our sprinklers broke and um that's another like couple hundred bucks that i was like what <laughs> and mm -hmm. then it's just like all these things happened and i'm like what the heck you know so i think something was in retrograde oh yeah i'm pretty sure well and they also say not to make it large purchases when whatever is in retrograde and i'm like but i had to, i couldn't wait you can make necessary Necessary purchases. Necessary purchases. I well, think of the word there. Like, what is the word? <laughs> so yeah, that's that's what happened. But also, um, it was just a lot with like school, and I had long videos that I was trying to edit. This happened towards the end of your trip. The computer dying. It happened towards the end of the trip. But there's just a lot of like long videos I was trying to edit. I was also trying to like, you know, do stuff with the kids and just all that fun stuff. So I'm sorry that I didn't give you a lot of content while Tim was gone. Don't worry, I filmed a lot of content. <laughs> so I have plenty to edit now. <laughs> yeah. Also, fun fact, after from Monday through Sunday when I went to bed, the total mileage that I walked slash ran, 63 miles. Whoa. So you know what Jackson wanted to do the first thing right when I came home? <laughs> he wanted to he race. He said, let's race. And I said, oh. <laughs> and so I tried. I tried my hardest to race, but I look like a like a little old man running. You wanna see what my run looks like right now? Yeah, yeah. Just to give you an idea. My lower back hurts. So normally this part of my back is always hurting mm -hmm. because I think because I wear a camera bag here on this side. Yeah. So it's like, I'm like this, but now both sides are hurting. Ooh. My hip flexors are hurting. We love symmetry. My quads are hurting. Oh yeah. I have a ridiculously large blister on the bottom of this toe. Heck yeah. That's my broken toe, by the way, in case anybody wanted to see it. You can see how it's like sideways now. Oh no, we're not we're not giving them feet content. Oh yeah. But here we go, here's my run. <laughs> this is why I had to run with Jackson. But what's funny is that the baby, I I gotta show you guys this. The baby's been doing a silly walk. Oh yeah. And you you does. literally look like him when you run. It's like a little raptor walk. Yeah, he goes, I go do a silly walk, and he does this. He thinks it's so funny. 
I liked it when I came home. He was like, Mar -mar -mar. he was so was excited. Fun. Yes, like he that. he was he was missing you. He would like he would he likes to say everybody's names. So he comes up and he goes, mommy, and I'm like, yes, and then he goes, Jackson, but he goes. Jackson. Jackson. <laughs> and then he's like, Daddy. And I was like, Oh, Daddy's not home right now, buddy. So Daddy will be home soon. But he would like do everybody's name, Mommy, Jackson, Daddy. And then finally, Daddy was here. Yeah. So it I also got to pick Jackson up from school today. Oh, it was so cute. And he was. He goes. I go Jackson. And he's like. And I was like standing right next to him. I'm like, I'm right here, buddy. <laughs> and he looks up and he's like, Ah. <laughs> and then I like picked him up and he was like trying to like climb on top of me. And was... Well, and I told him he knew that you were coming home today So it wasn't a surprise or anything. He was just excited. I think he just forgot like I think he didn't put it together Yeah, and then he saw you and he was he wasn't so excited expecting to see me coming out at the school Didn't didn't think you'd see me. Yeah, but yeah, it was uh, it was very very cute <laughs> um, So yeah, okay, so what I wanted to show you though Tim set up a little table in here, but this is my old computer this Did is we my. Show them? I never. So I took it, took the screen off again. Yeah. And I didn't want to like glue it back on. Oh, so he yeah he taped so it. So I just taped it back on because I wanted to like make sure that it was working. And then it was working, and then I just never got around to gluing it back on. Not a big deal because we're done with it now. Yeah. <laughs> but this is my new one. It's a little bit smaller because it doesn't have like this. Well, that's just the monitor. Yeah. The actual computer is here. There it is. I went to the Apple store. Oh, that's the other thing. Tim bought the bought the computer while he was gone. And he's like, okay, I just need you to go pick it up. So I went to the Apple store at the mall at Millennia, not realizing that it was a Saturday. Walked into the, the mall is so busy. It was wild. The Apple store, I've never seen a store that busy. There were literally, no joke, 900 employees. Oh 900? no, is this, is this supposed to be? Yeah, oh, okay. The there were so many Apple employees in that store. I was like, what is happening? <laughs> like, so, um, ooh. Wow. Is that allowed? Yeah, see how much screen there is compared to your other one? Yeah, it's all screen. It's, it's like, like the a little tiny bezel, I think. Oh. I don't know. I'll we'll have to turn it on and see. Interesting. It's nice. It's a nice computer. But, um, and I like a big monitor. I'm sure, like, this... This specific computer is not a necessity for editing YouTube videos, but I like the big monitor. It, I, it makes it, I'm not like arching my neck as much as I do with a smaller monitor. It just, this is easier for me to edit on. I almost got you a new laptop, but this ended up being like $500 cheaper than the same specs in a laptop in mm. a MacBook Pro. Cause, and also we would still have to buy a monitor because I would set you up with a monitor in the MacBook Pro. Oh, I see. So, yeah. That's why. I, I mean, think. that could be a monitor, no? That other computer? Yeah. Well, if it's gonna constantly turning off. No. Oh, it, it, it <laughs> like wouldn't work as just. Okay, yeah. I see. All right. Well, but so I'm in the Apple Store. There's like literally 900 employees. It was wild in there, and it was so loud. I could never work in an Apple Store. There, it was so incredibly loud in there. It was like a party. But everybody was spending like a million dollars on. Apple visions and Apple phones and watches and computers and I was just like get me out of here well, They just <laughs> released the new Apple uh, The phone the, they didn't release the phone. But she the girl them. the girl at the Apple store said um, that they were gonna release a phone soon They yeah. were gonna announce a phone soon. Yeah, they announced new phones new watch and new um, AirPods ah so yeah, she was like, don't buy a new phone right now. Wait till we like announce the one. And I'm like, I'm not buying a phone. I just bought this computer. So <laughs> we just got phones. yeah, we did. We just got new phones. Cause I was still rolling with a 10 for a while there. But the other thing that I was supposed to be working on while Tim was away was finishing getting our guest bedroom ready. And I never got a chance to work on that. So that was a bummer. So that's something that we're also going to be working on this week. And you'll probably see that like interspersed with the trip videos. So that's, I'm excited for that. That's something that I like, I really do enjoy is like changing, changing spaces basically. Like I'm looking around my office and I'm like, man, I want to like change this whole entire office. I just, I feel like sometimes a refresh like helps with my mood. You know, were you, were you ever like a kid and you would like rearrange your room like in high school or middle school or whatever? Did you ever do that? You talking to me? Yeah. I did it once. One time? One time. Let's see, how does it look? 
Look at that. There it is. You got your SD card reader. Oh no, why why does it have smudgy weird stuff on it? Because I just touched it with my hands. Where do you see smudgy weird stuff? Where? I thought I saw something. Maybe not. Was it just my fingerprints? Were you seeing this thing? But that has like a smudge oh, around right it. Here? Yeah, what is that? I think it's just dust. What? Thing's brand new. I'm just sitting on the ground. What do you want me to do? You're sitting in your chair. I was going to sit in your chair and then I started working on sitting on the ground. No, I don't think you made it dusty. I think it was like dusty in the box. No, this is a fingerprint smudge. Oh, jeez. Oh, brother. This is like the cyber truck of Apple computers. No, I hope not. Look at all this stuff on the back. Yeah. Wow. So many plugs. I like to rearrange things. I think it makes me happy. Change. Although I don't like change, a room changing makes me happy. Does Look that make at sense? Me. I'm it made people, people happy. <laughs> um, so yeah, okay. So Tim's gonna get this computer all together, and then I'm gonna start working on all the stuff I couldn't work on while he was away. Yeah. Okay. All right. Be right back. All right. Good morning. It's the next day. I think there was a snake in the pool. Let me see. They're, they're getting the snake out of the pool. Daddy. Daddy. <gasps> that was the snake. Wait. 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 Whoa. Uh oh. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh no. Uh oh. Okay. Alright, we're taking the snake and putting him back where he belongs. Which is not in the pool, right buddy? Right Oliver, what did you see? Do. Daddy. Yeah, Daddy. Do. What did Daddy do? Do. Alright. So we got the computer pretty much set up. The only thing is I just realized that this doesn't have like speakers in it. So the sound is coming out of here now. Listen. Morning. It's like all tinny. Yeah, it doesn't sound, it doesn't sound great. So now I have to use my headphones while I'm editing and I don't normally do that. I normally edit like just with the sound coming out of the computer. I think what it is is I just don't like change. I want my old computer back. So that's where I'm at. <laughs> but I did clean up my desk a little bit, which is now feels a little bit better in here. So that's nice. It feels less, less cluttered, still cluttered, less cluttered though. And then I found this, I, we got this for Adam, um, a while back and I, we forgot to give it to him. We see him not like super often, but I was like, Oh, I think Adam would like these. So we bought these little silly things, but we never gave them to him. So anyway, I'm going to edit now with my headphones. Here I go. <laughs> and then, That's my belly. Sorry. Tim is doing some shredding. We had a bunch of paperwork that we were like, wah, wah, wah. That was me shredding, like, by the way. For whatever reason, I just like keep every bit of paper. If somebody hands me- stuff from like 2006. He found stuff from 1994. Like, I need to learn how to throw things away. <laughs> what am I doing? I think what happened is, both my parents and your parents like instilled a fear in us that if we don't shred everything, <laughs> we are going to. You're, somebody's gonna steal your identity, you're, you're or gonna, some, somebody's gonna dig through your trash can. Yeah, the worst thing in the world's gonna happen to us. So we like <laughs> we want to shred everything, including things that are like, this is the envelope to mail back your bill in. <laughs> yeah. And I'm like, okay, we don't need to shred that. It's okay. Uh, you know, you here's know your insurance policy with none of your personal information on it, just like a, a quote but, for insurance. Uh, I still feel like I need to, I don't know. You know what else I found though when I was cleaning, which is, this is exciting. I found some SpongeBob temporary tattoos. Ooh. I might have some, I might have a full SpongeBob sleeve next time you see me. Maybe not though. I'll have a full Gary sleeve. <laughs> there is a Gary in here. Look, let me show you. There's Plankton, Squidward. This one changes color in the sun. So that's Ooh. cool. A little cutesy SpongeBob, Gary. Very demure. A, a little Patrick with some, he's, he looks kind of like, uh, you know, and then what's her name? Sandy. Sandy. This, I thought she like was tooting. I thought this was like a toot clout. A fart clout? Yeah. What's but it's her, doing? it's her tail. What's she doing with her fingers? She's doing that thing where like, you know, when you, you do know, that. Like punch them or whatever? Yeah. And somebody like, you know what I mean? It's like the thing that the boys do. Yeah. So yeah, exciting stuff. I thought Jackson might like it. Although, you know what? He doesn't really love temporary tattoos. Yeah. He, he kind of gets like really upset. I put one on him one time after the, I think the doctor's office gave us one, like instead of a sticker. And he's like, what's that? And I put it on him and he was like, no. And it like wouldn't come off because it's like, a tattoo. Get it off. Yeah. So then we had to really quick find like some alcohol to like get the, you know, like get it off. 
So maybe we won't give it to Jackson. He's yeah. not he's not really a fan. But yeah, now I'm gonna edit this video that you're watching right now. Ooh. Editing magic. Well, look at that. Yeah. Science, baby. <laughs> All right, it is later on. Hello. Jackson's home from school. <laughs> where where did you just come from, bud? The dentist. What did the I know, now we're we're playing uh, Mario Kart for as a little reward for being so good at the <gasps> dentist. What'd the dentist say? My teeth are very good, but one tooth has a stain. He did say that there's one tooth we gotta make sure we brush extra good. And they even, so we brought Oliver with us this time because he's gonna go to the dentist next time. So Oliver will be coming to the next dentist appointment and he'll be getting his teeth cleaned at that appointment. So, but Jackson did great. He had a great appointment. His teeth are nice and clean. There is one tooth, because he has these two teeth that are very, very close together. And so we just have to make sure that we get in between those teeth really, really good. So that is, that was our one little problem area, but no cavities, nothing like that. So he did great. He's been brushing his teeth so good at home. We're very proud of him. And Oliver will be going to the next appointment and getting his teeth cleaned. And he was very intrigued by the cleaning process. So I think, I feel like he's gonna do okay at the uh, at his appointment because he's so, he loves brushing his teeth. That's one of his things. He goes, toothbrush? But like after the after his bath every night, he goes, toothbrush? So. So there you go, but I think this is where we're gonna end it. I think this is gonna be the end of our multi-day home vlog. I'm sorry that I didn't show you more while Tim was away, but I hope that you enjoyed the things that I did show you. And I hope you enjoyed all of the turmoil that we went through with the computer. <laughs> um, but now everything's great. The new computer is great. I love it. Here's a look at the office. It's still a little bit messy, but it's way cleaner than it was. So this will be my next big project to tackle. But there it is, this is the new computer. There's the actual computer piece right there. I'm using this as a speaker right now, which is just like a little oomph, like pool speaker, but honestly, it works great. And then here's my monitor. It's wonderful. It's working fabulously. So there, there you go. That was our home vlog. But um, soon you'll be seeing all of the trip videos. So all of the traveling to LAX, running the races at Disneyland, his time at Disneyland. So look forward to that stuff coming up very, very soon. But until then, tell everybody bye. Oh, bye everybody. <laughs> Am I supposed to say all in all, it was a fantastic day. What are you doing, buddy? Are you well, making that, a fishy face? And with that being said. Is that your fishy face? <laughs> but you're being so silly. Oh, he's, he's making like a popping noise, like a oh, oh, like that with his cheeks. Oh, the other thing that was so cool was at the dentist, Jackson was getting his x-rays and she was counting. You know how they count like, I'm gonna count to five and then you know she does the x-ray thing. And so she goes one, two, three, four, and the baby goes, five! Yeah. That's so great! Five. I'm so proud of him! Yeah. He goes, yeah. yeah. Can you count? So One, there you go. Two, three, Look, I four. Won. Dad, I won and you did it. <laughs> oh, yeah. He said, I, I, can't, I can't perform under pressure. But um, anyway, long story short, thank you guys for hanging out with us. We appreciated you guys being there for me. I'm proud of you guys. Yes, for being there while all of everything was falling apart. You guys did great. <laughs> Thank you for all of your support. But all of her support. We will see you tomorrow with yeah, a new video. Oh no, it was a fantastic day. And with that being said, we are off. We'll see you all tomorrow. <laughs> and now it's time to pay the price. He's like doing slow motion where it's hitting me with the red turtle shell. <laughs>